Hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening to you all, depending on your time zone. Rosie Variety TV saying thank you to the old and new subscriber and about to. May God Almighty bless you all. We are on topic that says we are role model to our children. Are we really? Are we really? Do we know it? If we really are, why do we talk to them anyhow? Why do we react to them anyhow? Why do we gossip in their presence? Why don't we control the way we talk in their presence? That is why I want to use this opportunity to let us know why we are role model to our children. Before we go there, don't fail to subscribe, touch that button, so that when another video is coming on your way, you'll be the first person to see it. After going through this video, Put your comment down on our comment box. Like the video. Always share this video to your loved ones, your well wishers, and people around you. God bless you. We are back. Let us know that we are what we eat. So mind how you eat or what you eat. Therefore, let us mind how we take care of our kids or react to our children. When you go to driving school, your teacher will first teach you the basics before you can move a car. You will count A before B, and you will count one before two. Without you counting A, you cannot count B. Also, without counting one, you cannot count two. Then, parents teach your children the basics. Every morning, your children see you saying, good morning, sir, good morning, ma. After food, you say, thank you, sir, thank you, ma. Believe me, before you know it, they will be doing the same because they see you do it. Remember that our younger ones copy more of what we do. So, let us be a good role model to our kids if we really want them to live a better life tomorrow. Who is God will help us and God really make them to live a better life tomorrow. As God, God will help us and help them in Jesus' name. Parents, do the way you wish to see in your kids. For example, tolerance, honesty, respect. Don't show selfish behavior. Do things for others without expecting reward. Show kindness and offer compliments. Visit their school and ask the teacher how they are doing in school. When your children do well in school, what you do determines the next result. What do we do? We try to take our children out. We appreciate them, make them happy. If you notice your child is not doing well in school, please follow that child up and you will be surprised to see change in that child. Learn how to appreciate your kids each time they go on errand for you. As the child grows, the character and behave a way of life changes. Don't always criticize, putting blame on them. Finding fault, let them know you will care for them and you love them. Environment is one important area that affects our kids' behavior. If possible, change the environment. Let us know this. Your tone of voice, your body language, and your every expression are observed by your kids. Your words and action as a parent affect their development more than anything else. As a parent, learn not to use bad words on your children, words like foolish or stupid. Do you not compare your child with other of your children? It's very bad. Each time they do wrong, always correct them instead of accusing them. Don't promise your kids with that you can't fulfill them because Children don't forget easily. Eat with your kids and always spend quality time with them. 
make a communication a priority. It makes you know more about them. As a parent, you should learn to understand your children. You do that by watching their behavior and how they act, such as when they are angry, sad, happy, frustrated, eating and sleeping patterns, and understanding their hobbies and the kind of friend they keep. If possible, teachers are included. In case you see different behavior in your child, you might be able to find when and where he or she got it from. My people, draw a line of limit for your kids. That limit will impose good behavior and self-control. For example, Time to read, time to play, time to rest. And most especially, monitor the kind of movie they watch. Let us try to listen to our children instead of ignoring them because we don't know what they want to tell us. Some of the things that happen at home will not have happened if only we pay attention to them. Also, don't react to your child every time try to control your emotion and be slow to anger you have to know this you don't expect your kids or your children to do everything to your liking we as parents have to take time to explain and make sure that the explanation is very clear so that they will understand our reason any suggestion you make or offer, give them an opportunity to share their own view or their own opinion too. It will help both parties. As a working parent, do the best you can do. Although we as parents are imperfect, only God is perfect. Let us know that we cannot do anything by our own power, except God is involved. So let us always commit our children into the hands of God. God bless you. God bless your children. Till another video will come on your way. Keep on tuning in. Bye.